Yes. Wimbo sponsored by Fish Sticks today, definitely. Um, I'd like to see him wearing a cowboy hat. We're at a chili place. It's any seafood place. Come on now. I like that. A different hat every match. That'd be good. I was considering wearing my graduation cap today, but um, I don't know. I just felt like it'd be too silly. Going to Battlefield. Wimbo breaking out the fox, finally. I haven't seen him play this character much today. He's been playing Falcon and, uh, Falcon and Luigi for some reason. I don't know really? why he went. Yeah, he went oh. Luigi against Trudat. I'm not sure what his, uh, what his thinking was there, but... Well, sometimes the matchup between the characters doesn't matter nearly as much as the other player not knowing the matchup. And if Chillin yeah. is not comfortable against Luigi, then what the hell or, not? Or uh, Chudat, rather. Chew, sorry, Chudat is not comfortable against I, I get him back and forth, too. They both start with C. <laughs> yeah. Ch, Ch, yeah, they both start with Ch. There you go. Oh, DP just very patient in the middle of the stage, man. Just got some good punishes off on Wimbo. Uh, that S smash is going to cost Wimbo a lot. Got to regain that stage control. Wemo's philosophy is all about fighting, so he wants to be in Falco's face. He wants to be getting hits off on Falco when he can. But, um, I feel like Wemo, sometimes Wemo can just try and make things happen a bit too much, and if he's not as familiar with DP style or whatever, he might not be able to uh, react and punish as well as he needs to. So. It's hard to dash dance against a Falco when you're getting lasered in the face every two seconds. Oh, great shine. He's but can make he make it back? Yes. Oh! So he didn't get sucked in too much by the uh, by the bubble there. You know, if you actually go off camera, you do get sucked down faster. So. Well, we're very much trying to fight right now. Throwing out a few get up attacks. Danny. Trying to apply that pressure on the DP. But DP, uh, DP just looks a, lo a little bit more relaxed in this matchup. Wimbo is looking like he's trying to uh, force some pressure and go in, whereas DP is just sort of going with the flow right now. You see him leaning back. He's doing his lasers, doing what he has to do. And then, of course, you know, getting his good spacey on spacey combos off when he needs to. Very interesting up tilt right there. Keeping the extension going. Just keeping Wimbo in the hit stun for ridiculously long. Yeah. Great, great game by Wimbo. Catch him jumping up there. But I'm going to need to see a little bit of a different play style out of Wimbo, I think, if he's going to want to take this set off of DP. Oh, that's unfortunate. <laughs> All right, hold on a second. Keeping with the best of five. Yeah, very shout-outs to the Nintendo for making this best of five. The players are aware, so no stage ban. So Wemba going straight to Yoshi's. Definitely his favorite stage. He's going to get a, a lot of space to fight that Falco. But uh, sitting in shield isn't the way to do it, Wimbo. He's going to lazy you and then go in whenever he wants to, so you can't let DP dictate the terms of the match. Great tech. Great angle to tech by Wimbo. Wimbo known for his tech skill, but um, he's going to want to show it off. He's got to get the right time to go in. So. Taking the time at the ledge. Wimbo making it with his way back to stage, but a down air catches Wimbo jumping above Falco. Good shot. Nice up smash. Okay. Can't quite follow up on that though. <laughs> Going for like, the kill. Yeah, one bow tried to wave dash back there and bait him into something, but still no stacks taken in the first minute of this match. It's crazy to do so. Interesting to see. Big back air. Not enough to kill him. Oh man. Is that after you're gonna do it? Wow, goes straight for him. A long stock, especially for <laughs> Some great uh, moonwalk chime action. But that was crazy. I just love how Wimbo went for the angle straight at him. It was a slight downward angle, just went straight in his face. Oh, Wimbo saved himself yeah. with that wall jump. Wimbo did a good job out of uh, staying higher on the shine so he didn't commit too far down. Get up attack. Wimbo's been getting a lot of get up attacks off on DP. So maybe DP is just. Not quite uh, anticipating it'll hit him that much. Well, Get up attack and be wonky like that When you like know that, that their style is all aggro, they're going to be on you 100% of the time. Really they're going to they're going to count on you missing those techs. Yeah. Again, just waiting up the ledge. DP tried to steal it, but Wimbo went up just in time. Great wave land back there. 
It's been pretty even this matchup. I think the stage is working out better in Wemba's favor. Good wave shine. Great Thunders combo. Pops Falco up and not able to get much, too much off of it. Or maybe I spoke too soon. I uh, almost got the edge guard. It's got to be big. Oh my goodness. Some Randall shenanigans, ladies and gents. Great shine. Getting Wemba showing off the power of that shine. Right, Deepy tries to apply the pressure. Great job punishing him with a shine. Going right in the gaps between his pressure. Interesting late hit back here. DP not able to follow up on it. Almost got his back again. Got uh, DP's back against the stage. Oh my goodness, great combo. Goes for another shine, but that time he goes on stage. And DP's gonna back hit back. The stage and gives him the opportunity for that yeah. up air. That would have been tilt. like the third shine kill he got, but a great wave land. Wenbo's wave lands, ladies and gentlemen. Always very impressive. I think it was like 2012 or something was the year that Wenbo never missed a perfect wave land. <laughs> like he just grinded them out so much that he was just so good at them. So. Uh, DP, I believe he won a Battlefield Dreamland. Okay, I understand. This is going to give Wembo more room to sort of run around and stuff, but we'll see how it goes. Great wait. Up smash punish. Up tilt. Oh, reverse hit in the air. Interesting. Not something you see very often. Uh, that's going to do it. Oh, I spoke too soon. Great text by Wembo. Stage positioning going back and forth so fast. Yeah, and spacey dittos, that's what it's all about. It's crazy how fast they can switch back and forth, and you know, if one character shines or gets the other off the stage, that's when, you know, I, I really think spacey, a lot of top level spacey matchups are won on, uh, won, on, won by the edge guards, you know, because the neutral game can change so fast running, like, across the stage, but, um, when one character manages to get the other off the ledge, you know, it comes down to a lot of very concise edge guarding, and that's really what can set players apart and take the stock, so, yeah, we'll see. DP shooting a little bit of lasers. Looks like he's trying to mix it up a little, hopping around the stage. Trying to make something different happen. Rising back here. But I'm oh wow. Another great shine by Wembo. He keeps capturing DP, jumping back on the, up onto the stage like that. It's working out really well for him so far. I think Wembo's done a very good job of adapting so far this set. You know, wasn't looking so great that first match, but it looks like he's really starting to figure some of DP's tricks out. Oh, those sniper lasers from off stage. Yeah, that was gonna do it. Took for your him. double jump. I think even if he did up B, he probably wouldn't have made it back or just would have gotten down there. So. Is that a shield drop? <laughs> See ya. Another good shine. <laughs> Curtains. If you're Falco and you're stuck below the stage against Fox, you should not be able to make it back. Well, against any character, really. No. Especially characters like Martha and Fox, though. Yeah. Wimbo doing very good on Dreamland. I think DB didn't quite realize how good Wimbo would be on the stage, and uh, I feel like Fox, you know, can really... If he's uh, on his game, he can really use the, sp the big space on the stage to his advantage to get around Falco's things. And I just don't feel like DP's been applying the right kind of pressure to Fox this match. He's going to do it. Good stuff to Wembo. Power of the 69, taking game three. Yeah, that's going to be a painful one, because now even if DP wins this next one, that counter pick, he's got two in a row. Yeah, Bot's coming over to give uh, DP some advice. I think he's going to tell him to take him to FD? Dreamland. Oh, right back to Dreamland. Okay, maybe give him uh, a little bit more suggestions for improvement, but um, hopefully there's a no mid-match coaching rule, because I'm not, not a big fan of that myself, so hopefully we won't see Boss give him a lot of tips mid-game. I just don't think that's fair personally, but we'll see. Couple jabs. I don't think I saw DP using the jab very much last game, but that falling aerial was never gonna work. So got on Wimbo by punishing him with it, but DP getting that stage control again. Dude. Looks like DP's not quite on point with his edge guards. If you're not quite on point with your edge guards in a space you did out, you might just lose, so we'll see. Yeah, that percent means nothing when you can die in two wins. Yeah, and especially when Wimbo's been getting these uh, gimping shines off on him pretty well for catching him out of his jump and such stuff like that. We live in though! Great DI! Only on Dreamland, but... Uh, 
these lasers made quick work of that. Yeah. And he did, I don't think he had a jump either. He paired him right out of his FD, so. Another shine by Wimbo. He's being very aggressive with his edge guarding and just covering all DP's options with that down B. Dancing around, using the platforms to avoid him during his invincibility and keeping them on even kill. Yeah. I think DP's like trying to find some way to mix up his uh, pressure against Wimbo, but. Not sure if anything's quite working out for him this one yet. Wow, Wimbo coming up with f -airs. He just wants to hit that Falco in the face so bad. I thought he was about to pull out another shine there, but he held back. Yeah, he was I scared of that forward beat. That, yeah, it was, it was smart of him to hold back. Wow, and this attack, f smash kind of Uh oh. Yeah, that would have done it. Even if he upbeat a little bit further up, he would have gotten hit by the down air. That would have been the end. So. An amazing option to help reach. Oh, time. I like the idea of that S-Smash. Uh-oh. I don't like this. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Mumbo losing a quick sack. <laughs> he just stared him down in his shield for a little while, but DP came quick out of it. Good backer off the platform to take the stack. So I think if Mumbo wants to take this match, he's going to have to get a couple quick scumbag edge guards. Very good patience coming uh, down here up from the ledge. Great Same. dash dancing by DP. Oh, oh. wow, that, I did not expect that down tilt to hit him out of his surface. Yeah, interesting uh, coverage option. That's like something you would expect to see out of a Marth, not a Falcon. Yeah. But ended up working out really well for him in the end, got a guaranteed down air to finish off. So. And once again, we have a set coming down to the last match. Yeah, these Counter losers. might determine the set. These losers quarters match. These best of five losers quarters. Pretty crazy. Again, shout outs to DC Esports Land, running a great stream here. Make sure you're following them on Twitch or uh, subscribing to them. Or I don't know, subscribing's a pay one, right? So I don't know if they have a subscription button yet. If they do, definitely do it. Yeah. Well, turn, follow them. If you would like to support DC Esports and you don't have money, at least turn off your ad block. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Click on that little ad block icon, disable for this site. You know, you guys know how it is. I don't even. I shouldn't even have to tell you at this point. So. Shout out to Hard Times Cafe in uh, Arlington. But here we go. Amazing right venue. Battlefield. If you were local at MDVA and you were watching the stream, you should be here. Yeah, definitely. The perfect place if you're a newbie to get acclimated. Yeah, we had 74 entrants and a bunch of them. Uh, we had quite a few guys who was their first tournament or like, you know, yeah. three or four months into the game or something like that. So, great place for pros and uh, newer players alike. I'd be interested to see how this counter pick works out for Wimbo. I don't think it would have been his first choice of a counter pick, but we'll see how it goes. An early stop to Falco. Wimbo looking slightly flustered right now. Hopefully this doesn't carry too much throughout the rest of the game. Great short. It's the only way he could have make it back. Another down tilt oh. from DP. It's really interesting seeing how the momentum shifted. Wow! Pivot up smash. Something you don't see from a lot of Foxes, but very impressive by Wimbo. Yeah, it's really interesting seeing how the momentum has shifted throughout the course of the set. You know, at the beginning, DP looked like he solidly took the first game. Wimbo really looked like he was shifting it back for the next two games, and then DP kind of figuring a little bit more stuff out last match, and hopefully Wimbo can get his confidence back here and keep this match close. Good up throw. Up here. I think the platforms on Battlefield can be a bit weird though and prevent you from really extending your combos as much as you want. But oh! Oh man. Oh, wow, that was a close. He had a read on that. His spacing was just slightly off. And that would have been a very valuable stock for him to take. So hopefully he doesn't uh, let that mistake cost him too much. DP's co oh! DP coming out big with the combos the and a great roll read. read. He was oh, turning that forward smash well before he attacked. <laughs> what about just using the roll? Sometimes it's okay to roll. Oh no. Oh no. Hate to see that kind of thing happen. Don't worry about it too much, Wimbo. You can bring it back. Up there. Tried to jab him out, but. Smash attack. Nice up smash. It's not over yet. 
and they were counting out. One stock is not a lead, especially when you got this matchup going on. But uh oh, it could be big. He's off the stage. Oh no. Uh, and he has been battlefield. And an unfortunate end. Wimbo gets knocked out and loses quarters, so I think that gives him uh, eighth place or seventh place. Yeah.